sometimes there's good stress. You know, the dog might lick their lip before they're about to get a treat or before mm-hmm. you put the leash on. They, they're just excited. So that's called eustress instead of distress. For a dog that we're walking with or training with, they can probably smell what we've got in our treat bag. So that's going to potentially affect the way that they behave um, in any training or any behavior modification that we're doing because they know that the treat that there are treats present. And definitely, if we're going to turn up to connect to the emotional experience of another, is to recognize that we're not responsible for it. When any of us, people or dogs, learn something, we have to go through different phases of learning. We have to acquire it, acquisition. We have to qu- acquire the skill. We have to become fluent at it. So it's we, we do it enough so that we're um, fluent. They're not understanding what I'm asking of them because I don't understand them. Yeah. yeah, their feelings, their emotions, what they're going through, how they have to live in the world.